Yeah, I'm gonna go for this. 44% appeal, that means we're gonna sell a ton. Money, 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 money. What is in this? Well, sales campaign turned out to be moderate success. Fame increased by 9%. Okay, so we're gonna have a ton of customers now. We give a best shot, kid. Uh, why, I, why, why these rogues are so, such a big failures? They keep failing their missions. Hello everyone, welcome to my new video, this time we're taking a look at a potion tycoon. I'm gonna spend about one hour, I'm gonna give you my uh, thoughts about it. Um, now, I tried to make this uh, video about around the time this game came out, on October 4th. Due to the reasons it's gonna, well, I'm gonna talk to about very soon, I had to delay this video for a bit. It took, it is required, usually I do my less f first look videos, last try videos, uh, completely blind. I never play through, well, I don't try to play the game beforehand, uh, I usually try to go blindly. But this game uh, required me a bit more time to, to spend with it, because, well, you'll soon see why. Now, uh, this game is fairly com it does have some about amount of complexity, it's not completely well, simple uh, for a tycoon. I seen much simpler tycoons. This is, does have a bit more complex. And before we're gonna continue, uh, if this video is does provide you some sort of value, is interesting, in, or well, you, you liked it, uh, do uh, do uh, press the like button. If you're super generous, subscribe. It will help uh, YouTube uh, send the message to show this video to more people. Uh, that's how YouTube works. More likes means more uh, people get to sh more people uh, will be shown this video. So let's start a new game and we'll see. Okay, so we do have a, a couple ways to play it. We can either play a scenario. There are two scenarios: plot one and plot two. Uh, di three difficulties: novice, uh, adapt, and master. And do we have a custom one, which we can basically this is like a sandbox. I played mostly. I tried to play a bit more on a, a plot one. This is kind of kind of tutorialish thingy uh, it has a bit of a uh, well tutorial kind of starts you off uh, with a uh, like basically out of a like base uh, if you start without tutorial uh, you don't get a base you have to build it uh, on your own now let's call okay how do we call ourselves uh, there are those potions. Yeah, very very uh, creative name. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going for don't consume my potions. <coughs> okay. Now, this is where I'd say do not uh, do the tutorial. Tutorial is crap. I tried to play... The reason I delayed re re making this video for so long because tutorial is absolute crap. Uh, it uh, doesn't uh, like it does provide you a lot of like it provides you information, but it's in the form of pop-ups. And the pop-ups uh, sometimes they have like a video site like clip attached to it, but it's uh, just bunch of like pop-ups, bunch and bunch of pop-ups. It's not like uh, yeah, this is uh, like you know that uh, how tutorial sometimes ah uh, you get like. You get a proper walkthrough, like you press, uh, it shows you press here, press here, and it, and it explains step by step. No, that's just not how tutorials work in this game. It's just a bunch of pop ups. And the biggest problem with uh, where this particular uh, tutorial system is that the, whole, the biggest mechanic with, which this game, this game has is potion making, and it's not very explained very well at all. Uh, that's the biggest, um, I'd say, con of this tutorial. So I'd say, if you wanna know how the game works um, at, in like more detail, like more in depth way, I'd say try to watch a, 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 some sort of video guide. Uh, you'll understand way better how to do things because, like I said, tutorial sucks. That's why uh, I had to play uh, a bit with this game. Usually I do, do sometimes include tutorials in my play, uh, first looks. This one is... Uh, I try to make it, but it's just a bunch of pop-ups. Okay, I'm not gonna do tutorial. Okay, we're gonna pause. Now, there are 
Um, okay, probably, yeah, let's uh, start with building. I'm probably gonna try and explain some basics, so if you want to play this game, you can, uh, you will be able to do some basic playing uh, after watching my own. So now there are two types of uh, rooms. There are ones on the ground and ones that are above the ground. Certain uh, building, some like furniture or how to say production uh, pieces, uh, which helps to produce uh, ingredients, uh, can only be underground. Yeah, some only above ground, etc. So you cannot place everything over here. Now we do have some depth to the base, um, quite deep actually, and uh, cool. you can build it up fairly high. Uh, let's see, yeah, this is the top level, and uh, this is a how deep you can build. Now, this is a chamber, this, which is going to be built above, and this is going to be uh, uh, built uh, below the ground. Uh, the, this is a staircase. Now, the biggest uh, problem I see the building system is that each of these pieces are not very outlined very well how you should be yeah, like interconnecting them sometimes you build something and it says oh no you're not connected it's uh, it doesn't really like shows you where is wait this is uh, uh, okay or maybe did they fix it I think they fixed it when I tried to make uh, uh, now uh, I have well I played this game a bit um, um, a week or two so uh, there could be some uh, changes because last time I tried to play there was no snapping so I think we added snapping uh, in some sort of patch so uh, like that with the your above ground building room now you can enlarge stuff you can make some some height adjustments. I'm not gonna do too much. This is just a uh, bottom level. Uh, I'd say build stuff at a like uh, you don't need, uh, like uh, space is at a premium in this game, so you do need to think about how you play stuff. Uh, like diagonally, it's very important. Yeah, we. I, th I think yeah, we added a bit of snapping, so. Uh, when I tried to play it with all snapping, there was no snapping, so it was difficult to tell if you like placing stuff correct or not. Okay, I'm gonna put uh, one above and one below, so that I could help multiple levels. Ah, nope, please do not delete my stuff, nope. Uh, right, uh, right, my button will return. I actually a bit forgot how to play this game. Uh, yep, that's gonna be fine. Enlarge. I'm gonna use full. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I'm just gonna leave it like so. Uh, for a at the beginning, you don't really need too much. It's gonna be fine. And you need will need one more room for staff above. Uh, this is uh, gonna be for something else. So now we do have uh, things like research, uh, like research. <laughs> okay, so there are a couple like buildings uh, where like storage. There's a this is a greenhouse. Too. Some uh, materials need greenhouse. Some needs cultivation boxes. Uh, it depends on the ingredients. Now you start the game with your start ingredients randomized. You never start with the same uh, set of ingredients. So uh, sometimes. You get luck and you only need greenhouses, sometimes you need only cultivation boxes, and sometimes you need a mixture of two, so you never get uh, just like the same type of stuff. Uh, pallets is where you store stuff. Now, we need a cooker. And you need a... Oh, wait, I placed a bit uh, too close. There you go. We need a bottler to bottle. Uh, the potion and we need a cooker to cook the potion now we need someone to store stuff mm. <laughs> oh yeah these are like your um, processing additional processing some ingredients require additional step before we can be made into potion now I, f I don't f I don't know if I uh, put enough uh, yeah 
I probably should have started with um, ingredients so that I would know what, what which of them, them I'll need. But we can deal with all these later on. Once we'll have our recipes, we'll know which ones we'll need. Because like I said, some ingredients for certain portions will require a specific uh, step. You can save a bit of money because you only see a start with 20,000 uh, 2000 gold. Um, Revenue, gold, whatever this is, and already spent 900, 900 of it. So I probably could just start like this even now. Um, we have some additional uh, things like, for example, cleansing crystals uh, and additional items we'll uh, research later on to improve, like, um, if the morale efficiency in uh, this build like in these chambers so this list is going to be much longer this is just the beginning so now with your shop shop it can only be above the ground you can take it to a second level i think and uh, or you can even have a second one over here now there are like departments i haven't like uh, gotten too much into them but basically it's like serves like a secondary shop now we need a, a cash register and uh, we'll need three of these placement large oak uh, cabinets and now we do have some signs which like prevents uh, customers uh, going to certain places you can use them, you cannot, uh, it's up to you. Now, uh, your staff will need chambers. So, I'll say start with uh, two and place like one, one here. Now, uh, it will depend uh, how many of these you'll need based on how many uh, employees you have. But start of, at the beginning, we'll, have, we'll not have too much, so this is going to be fine. Uh, now there are like decorations you can use. Uh, you start with one uh, like relic, which is it lets you work as a store stamina faster when resting in the room, increases room rating by five. We can we can place this uh, one for free, and it's gonna provide a bonus for this particular room. I'm gonna for now I'm gonna play, press OK. Now let's take a look at a war uh, like this, this whole hiring stuff now we will need a cook or in this time it's called an alchemist to cook stuff so we're gonna hire one which is uh, i think go for uh your currency oh yeah that's right your currency is like hats or something uh, no wait no no uh your tycoon points like hats uh, it costs you these things to sometimes like start a like to hire something even it's uh, cost you 10 uh, gold or whatever this is uh, to upkeep your worker you do have an a, like a action cost of these hats the coon points whatever we call them uh, now i'm gonna go for the cheapest ones i'll be able for 20 okay it doesn't matter we'll go for 20. sometimes prices can uh, be different uh, wages can be different. Okay. Uh, we need operators. Operators basically do the. Uh, uh, let's see. These ones. Operators operates, operate these ones. And cookers only do the cooking and the bottling. So we basically use them. Now let's see. Do we have any. Okay, 10. Okay, operator, 10, 10, 10, and 10. Okay, so we all are like 10 gold, 10 each. What? Why can I ha hire? Uh, ah, oh, yeah, I'm in the construction mode. That's why. Uh, I'm no longer in construction mode. Why are you not letting me hire? Okay, now you're letting me. Okay, we're gonna hire one operator. It doesn't really matter right now which, since we all cost the same. Uh, we have a clerk, and that's enough. Now we need a, one gardener. Well, we can only hire one gardener for now. These guys basically grow our uh, uh, 
uh, ingredients. Now, you will have like a bottleneck sometimes uh, when it comes to like growing stuff. Depends how how much of an ingredient is used because one ingredient can be used in multiple recipes for uh, multiple different uh, potions. Uh, greasers, if uh, if my memory doesn't uh, uh, yeah, if my memory doesn't uh, uh, fail me, it's we are like uh, extra like may help carry stuff around. You don't really need them uh, since processors basically gonna carry stuff around. Uh, now we are managers, uh, this is a bit later comes in, you don't really need them right now. Maybe I should hire one greaser just to make sure we have, okay, this greaser, yeah, maybe we should have one. I'm gonna go one which has um, clerks trait, uh, since clerks are needed for like research and uh, no, research is needed, uh, cook, um, alchemists do the research uh, and uh, clerks do marketing. So this all another thing like marketing and stuff. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna reach this in the tutorial, in like this video. I'm just gonna uh, tell you what it is. So I'm gonna hire, okay, let's see. Yeah, doesn't matter. I'm just gonna hire one. Okay, so we're starting all of them uh, now let's uh, take a look at uh, uh, alchemy that way we'll know which uh, not alchemy how uh, we'll now do some potion making so that way we'll know what kind of processing we'll need and how much uh, stuff we we'll need to build after that okay so uh, you start the game with a few uh, objectives these are like basic uh, base setup Right now we don't have cultivation box and greenhouse, that's because I haven't built them. Uh, then we need... Uh, well, I suppose I could build one. Let's see. Maybe I should build one. I'm gonna make it large, that way I can place some stuff. I'm gonna pl place uh, one pallet and uh, one cultivation box and one greenhouse. Now I'm not sure if I'll need just one of them, one each, sometimes you need multiples, but for now it's gonna be plenty enough. Okay, so let's make a few portions. Uh, quarters, bonehouse production lines, yeah, uh, pilot cooker, bottle machines, these ones will uh, become available once we are built. After that, yeah, let's let them first build it, that way we'll know what kind of uh, after that um, objects will get usually it's like um, uh, sell certain amount, amount of certain type of uh, potions we go we finished one we about to finish others we finish another one yep once we're gonna finish building stuff we go now we have three Quest. We can be a supply depot. This is basically potions like uh, uh, which has um, provision trait. Now I'll talk about traits a bit later. Uh, there are like this one, uh, sorcerers, which is basically magic potions, and uh, apothecary is basically like health potions. Uh, yeah. So um, let's see what kind of uh, ingredients we we'll have. That way we'll know which. Um, of these we can uh, do first now okay so we have now there are two types of ingredients one are like elemental ingredients usually marked with like uh, water one of these fours basically we can appear in any of these slots you'll soon figure out how, why, uh, how it works okay so we're starting with a water and we have uh, and this ingredient, so we can make a sleep potion. So we can make, uh, uh, me. Let's see. I think this is uh, gonna be, uh, yeah, the heart uh, next to the uh, moon symbol. This, uh, which again is a bit annoying since I cannot hover over 
keep with the tool tip in place and just hover over. So uh, heart symbol uh, indicates with a basic like health related potion. Uh, star symbol uh, uh, potion of summoning basically means um, uh, sorcery and the, like mountain uh, the, the green the green symbol means like provisions. So right now we have ability to make a a po so we have one potion for basically like provis provisions and one for sources so we can do two potions right now let's throw two of these ingredients now we have like additional like additional traits this is basically marks uh, what kind of uh, that is a health potion uh, it means bland no and so some of these like will give you attractiveness bonus like appeal bonus and then you have impure bonus you can get you can get rid of uh, impure bonus now uh, let's see if i can do that okay uh, who gives me impurity uh, uh, yeah that's impurity so we'll go for this one now once you click on ingredient you have like Four of you can you can take four of uh, these steps. One of these steps basically uh, matches the processing building we need. For example, uh, dried you will need the uh, drying kiln. I think it's called, called. blanching needs a, a different processing building. Uh, crushed uh, requires like uh, cr I for I can forget the, the names of uh, some of the stuff. And then pickling pickled that means you need to pickle. Uh, now let's see, uh, which would remove, okay, we, see I sliced it off, we lost all, all the stuff, if we go the other way, we still gonna keep the impure, uh, and it doesn't ha help anything, so we have to go this way, 1.5, 23% uh, appeal, so we still have done, we still haven't uh, get rid of, of uh, impure because we have another impurity over here now we can slice top like uh, vertically I or diagonal but I think diagonal if we go we go will get toxic or anti-toxic trait let's see uh, let's see let's see let's see okay potency of two appeal 24 and we don't have any impurities let's see if we go for crushed 33 percent appeal 1.2 uh, potency. Now, uh, appeal basically means how it's how likely um, a client is uh, is gonna be how likely is, uh, for a client to buy it. Now I wanna check if if I gonna go for this. Yeah, this is definitely. Let's see. Can I do anything about it? Yeah. No, we have to stay with this. Uh, I think later on you get more arcane powers. Basically, arcane powers means how many ingredients you can put, if I understand correctly. But I didn't get to, I didn't get to the point where I get more of them. So I make assumptions that we get more uh, arcane powers later on as we research stuff and etc. Uh, etc. Et 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 so our portion is going to be 1.5 potency and 33% uh, appeal. Now, uh, at the beginning of the game, you don't have much uh, options for like uh, your potions uh, items. Uh, later on, you do get more um, I like uh, customization option options, which will will boost uh, appeal, and you will it, you'll be able basically even charge more money, or even you'll have to charge more money because this green area, which is like the most appealing price, will maybe move like into this po uh, po uh, portion of price slider this is a slider by the way okay so now we need to name this potion um yeah naming is not my uh, my best skill so i'm gonna okay so gonna go for pur pur purple uh this is a uh, sorcery no wait it's not a sorcery it's a sleep potion sleep potion okay sleep 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 sleep, sleep. what kind of okay what kind of a uh, hmm. let's go for black black 
Nah, it's not go it's gonna be that difficult to, to remember. Um, nah, let's give it black. Now you have like different materials for the cork. Uh, you have like ability to change this part. There are different shapes. Uh, uh, now we're starting on the corks, and after that we'll get different shapes and colors and and more bottoms a bit later on as we play and research stuff. Okay, so what name I'm gonna give this? This is a sleep a sleeping potion. So, um, okay, let's see. Yeah, naming is really bad, so I'm gonna just keep it uh, sleep potion. I wanted to come up with something like interesting, but uh, eight hours of work uh, at my as a web dev uh, knocks out all your creativity to come up with stuff. Unfortunately, so yeah, everything looks fine. Sleep potion. Know what I'm gonna do? What I as a dev I usually do 1.1, 1.0. Now you will have to make like um, uh, eventually you'll be able to like create a better potion so you'll may want to create like steep potion 2.0 or something which will be maybe something like this but more potent and maybe more appealing as you get more parts i don't know if you can uh, upgrade a, an existing recipe uh, i can't actually forgot to check when i played the uh, when i started playing my game so uh, unfortunately so I'm gonna need this as uh, sleeping potion 1.0. Okay, now we have sleeping potion 1.0. So now we need to assign it. There we go. We assigned this to this cabinet. We'll set. Maybe I should. Now we're gonna uh, assign potion for brewing. Choose potion. And we need. Okay. So we need Elven Saddle and Dead Man's Finger, Blanche and Pickled. Uh, so we need Blanchers and Pickles, Pickling. I think so, there you go. Pickle, Pickling. And we need uh, Kettle. Kettle is for, for, for Blanching. Uh, cut the bottom of ingredients, request, okay. Yeah, there you go. For now we need uh, these two, let's add it into our kitchen. Now we can make one more uh, one more ingredient, uh, one more potion, uh, which is going to be our provision. Ag again we're going to go for, we'll try to remove impurities. Hmm. We basically need to play around with having, like putting halves in and out. Until you get to uh, oops, wrong, wrong half. There you go. Uh, 24. Unfortunately, you cannot like placing uh, differently. Like, position, position in the, in the pot doesn't matter. Um, it's all about the tags. About the tags about the appeal and the potency. So we have potency of 2 and uh, and appeal of 24. Unfortunately, we cannot make this potion in any shape or form uh, more appealing, so we will have to approach this how good it's gonna be. Okay, so we're gonna go for brown color. Maybe let's do like this. We'll randomize a few times. Okay. So, for uh, tutorial sake, uh, not tutorial, for first as is first impression game uh, gameplay, I'm gonna just call it provisions, since I'm not gonna have multiple types of provisions for this particular uh, video. So this is good enough, but like I said, I, I would normally would call it like provisions 1.0 or something if i need to make a more updated potion later on with better like uh, bottles corks etc uh, to increase appeal okay we'll assign this 
into this cabinet and we'll add now we could go for a second cooking cooker but um we only have one uh we'll have only one gardener so we'll not be able to make a bunch of ingredients at the same time so kind of pointless to uh try to scale operations of your kitchen right away plus you'll run out of, out of money uh, okay so let me check what kind of ingredients i need right now now we have a products so we we'll need a Alban saddle and dead man's finger and we need Alban saddle and asparagus asparagus so this is gonna be probably uh wait 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 using oh so okay so in this particular gameplay we don't have in we don't have any ingredients which requires greenhouse like i said sometimes you don't you, sometimes you only need uh this particular growing uh building to grow stuff and sometimes you only need greenhouses sometimes you need both this time i got a lucky rng and only need one type of which is a west wing now we'll say yes we let stuff run run through okay now let's assign ingredients in asparagus asparagus i think this is how it's called I pronounce properly dead man's finger and then we'll assign elven saddle okay and our gardener is now working uh we do start with some amount of um, ingredients so we're not starting completely without not anything so yeah as you can see this is now waiting for ingredients now we want to start uh, researching stuff as soon as possible so uh, i'm probably gonna build a small room over here just to provide a platform this is gonna be a research or maybe no let's put it here for now because we don't we don't have a second we don't need uh, a department of of maybe another seller like another um cash cash uh, cash reg register with more of these so we're gonna make this into a our research now it was there you go research There you go, let's let them build. I could hire a second uh, cooker because while well, one um, alchemist, it's not a cooker, it's a alchemist. Once one alchemist is doing his research, another one will be, well, it's nothing, no one will be making potions and then you end up with a situation when you have run out, out of potions and no one, you have nothing to sell because your alchemist is, well, doing the research so we let, let them build stuff just to make sure i am going for correct yeah we need an alchemist uh so i'm gonna go hire another alchemist just to make sure we're not gonna get a bottleneck yep uh 20 gold yes let's get you and we're gonna start with a research right away now as you can see with uh, tech tree is long some uh, tech uh, like research will give you multiple uh, things this time we are go getting marketing desk and small book uh, shelf to uh, increase rooms rating now uh, marketing will require a bit um, a promoted worker to work uh, novice workers cannot uh, work and it requires a clerk a a, a promoted clerk so we're gonna go for let's see zip zones yeah let's go for marketing right away oh looks like i don't have what five or more i have ten what oh yeah oh 15 yeah uh I, i'm I, i'm lacking a bit of 
uh, of cats. We'll have to wait a bit. Now we are the tabs like production. This is what you're producing. We are like uh, how many uh, keep in storage. Uh, repeat all, uh, how long. Uh, if you want to make like um, infinitely, you can delete. You can pro uh, production schematics. Uh, you can increase like uh, put in different queues with uh, your ingredients queue. Uh, then we are factions. Now factions. Uh, we are multiple factions in this game, like wizards, witches, guards, rogues. We basically require different potion potion types to keep them happy. Now, each of these cards basically are like um, a named character which will give you extra stuff or bonuses if you can make them happy by, do, by completing their missions. Uh, failing their missions uh, don't have any penalties, it's just uh, extra stuff. Okay. Yeah, we'll have to wait a bit until okay, I'm gonna speed things up while our alchemists and uh, workers doing their stuff. Uh, later on, as we'll get more and more tycoon points. Uh, one of alchemists will work here. After all, after that, we, we always can all we can always do a second uh, cooker and let a another our second uh, alchemist do some cooking. There you go. We are now stocked with some sleep potions and we start to make some money. Okay, Dale uh, Dichovni. I think this is how it's uh, pronounced. The king has introduced this plot of land uh, to your hands. We uh, hope that one day, uh, one day your house will be elected a new royal potion house where illustrious private supply of royal court, the tallest mountain peak. In the okay. So basically, uh, we say fluff text. It's not a mission. Now, this is a like uh, your bonus. Sometimes you can you get sometimes special events. Which can either help you uh, make stuff or sell stuff, or can hamper you, or sometimes like give you uh, incentive to like produce a specific type of potion to make so that uh, it sells, or sometimes just says what well, an ingredient will just grow slower. Uh, all kinds of uh, events, some good, some bad, some some sometimes. And some requires you to have ingredients to take advantage of certain event. Alright. Oh, okay. I have now enough uh, hats, so I'm gonna go for marketing. Because eventually we have a quest to do marketing now. We do have additional stuff. Uh, okay, lunch report. Uh, yeah. So yeah, uh, every time you make a brand new potion, you get a, like... A product reception uh, review kinda like gaming g like games get like their reception review and uh, video like, um, movies and such how uh, your clients this like how we received uh, the potion Sk okay so we get a uh, fame increase by six percent for four days the potion is now accepted for okay and we get a like newspaper. I'm not gonna need absolutely everything because uh, it's gonna take forever. Okay. We will we want to, we will eventually want another uh, gardener because gardeners is basically what's gonna uh, move stuff around uh, by producing more and more and more stuff. Uh, let's see if if in during a new day we have a another gardener. Yes, or higher. Yes, this one is expensive. Gardener pri primary skill, secondary skill. Yeah, I'm gonna. Hmm, my hats. Yes, I need more hats. Research completed of the basics. Okay.
but so I'm gonna have a second gardener uh, ingredients will go much faster uh, the biggest problem I see that I'll need another pallet that means this one needs to go a bit elsewhere I'm gonna move this into here this is gonna be our greenhouse I don't need it to be very big just to house this particular greenhouse so that I could put here a pallet because the more stuff you have the more stuff you can keep you go stuff taken care of yeah I'm out of potions right now Wait, did I forgot to build another. Wait, a second, 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 second. Um, I think I forgot something. So, yeah, okay, you need pickled and you need blanched and you need crushed and blanched. So, oh, I forgot one additional processing. Yeah, I need a mortar. Whoops, I almost forgot. I forgot a very sp important thing. Okay. Now it's gonna produce uh, crushed ingredients for a potions. For potion, they go. It it needed the ingredient. Sometimes stuff like this can become like a bottleneck, so you need to keep a keep an eye on stuff like this. Okay, okay I think I can hire a second uh, gardener. Okay, gardeners, gardeners, gardeners. Yeah, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go for the cheapest garden I can get. Or higher, yes. Because I don't want to spend uh, too much daily on like on money. Because you can go bank bankrupt if you overspend and you're not making enough money. Now, uh, two gardeners will keep stuff moving along, and uh, one cook cook should be able to cook enough potions to stock things up now we have our provisions all of them now we have, will have something to sell perfect we sold uh, seven potions this day so let's see how we're gonna do this this particular day okay now we have a sleeping potion as well okay, we have a event now this is the VAPs this is a, a guard it requires two crates of health potions our health potion is basically sleep potions so we need two crates that means two item uh two items i'll see yes i think sh i should be able to do it we have four days to do it uh this is gonna be a good opportunity to show you how to do this stuff if my potions are not gonna slow down and i'll be able to get it okay now, this is the ingredient trader. Uh, this is how you acquire basically additional ingredients. There are, well, there are basically two ways to get the ingredients. You can either buy from the, this uh, uh, trader, or you can complete a, like, I think it's a rogues. No, I think sorcerers. Like sorcerers and witches, you can get ingredients from them for completing mission like this. Uh, like the one like we're doing right now. Sometimes it's like you get a fame boost. You can ex you can get extra uh, uh, client or two out of them for completing this, or you can get an ingredient for free. Uh, this time uh, we're not getting that. I don't have money to buy it. These ingredients are fairly expensive, so I cannot afford it now. So I'm gonna see decline because I overspent on other stuff. Uh, let's see what do we get in here uh yeah it doesn't say sometimes it says what we'll be getting but this time it doesn't there you go provisions as uh for sars nice very nice yeah stuff is moving along we may need another processor process uh operator to operate stuff uh, because, like I said, the faster you can turn ingredients into processed ingredients into your cooker, the more 
stuff you can make, the more stuff you can make, you can make, well, you can complete missions like this much faster. So let's see if we have more pros operators for her. Unfortunately, we don't have, so unfortunately, I cannot take advantage, advantage of that. So we'll have to wait next day. Maybe next day we'll have an available operator to hire to operate uh, processing equipment in, so that we can make more potions and we could complete this mission. Okay, it's almost next day. Um, am I missing anything else? Uh, oh yeah, you do have competitors. Uh, your competitors will come up with uh, uh, better potions, uh, better potency, more appeal, and your current potion eventually will be no longer effective, and you'll have to make uh, better potion to basically beat your competitor. Uh, what else? I'll have your uh, ledger, ingredients, we looked at that, products, goals, yeah, we have a bunch of goals, this is like additional missions, actions, oh yeah, uh, as you uh, sell stuff, you'll have uh, demand stuff, like, is it high demand or just okay demand for particular potion, for example, potion of silence, high demand, and steep potion is high demand as well, so... Here we have... Like, oh, we sold uh, 17 sleep potions and 5 provision potions. Let's see, can I actually do this quest now? No, we don't. Yeah, not enough items. This is gonna turn into green, eventually. Then we have enough of them in stock. Let's check uh, workers if we can hire someone who has operator trait. Yes, we can. Then, then gold. Yes, let's hire. That way we can operate multiple of these and turn uh, ingredients into potions faster, so we could finally fulfill this mission. Go. Well, now stuff should be moving along much faster. There we go. We completed a, a different mission and we got a department store. Now this is a yeah, when I was talking about uh, having multiple of these with multiple uh, types of potions. This time it requires to have create two medium departments by offering two of two potions in two different categories. So. Uh, so basically we need a, to have another store level, like over here maybe, and offer uh, and offer two potions in two different categories. So we can, I, I think we can just repeat this or just have a uh, different potion. But that, right now we don't have ingredients to uh, satisfy this uh, second part of the requirement. And you have to maintain it for 48 hours. Oh, okay, we can find the complete this. It requires two of these. Send them out. Okay. Thanks for support. Uh, this will help us to uh, be safe. Now, oh, okay. So we can get a random ingredient or a sack of coins with the perfect. We can get more money, but the time we have money, I'd rather get an ingredient, which is a free ingredient, which will allow, will allow me to make more potions. I got nice shade. That means we can make another a, a new potion. It's a elemental. This is an elemental, and it's basically for sorcery. Now with this particular one, we can make summoning potion or we can make conjuring potion. Either one, either one will be work. Okay, let's drop this in. Uh, let's go for a potion of summoning. 
Like previously, we're gonna try to remove impurity. There you go. 25. Let's see, can I get this more? Mm. 24, but 34% appeal. If I go this way, 25 appeal. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go for this. What would happen if I go for this? Ooh, 44% appeal. Mmm, more sellability. Yeah, I'm gonna go for this. 44% appeal, that means we're gonna sell a ton. Money, 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 money. Okay, we're gonna go for this. I'm good with this. This is gonna be summoning potion. Let's make this like this. Let's randomize it. Make this summoning potion 1.0. This is gonna sell a ton. So, we'll assign it. Uh, we'll assign into the queue to be manufactured. Now, what do we need for this? We have Dead uh, Man's Finger and we need Nightshade. I think Nightshade is gonna be here, if I remember correctly. Yes, we'll add Nightshade to the greenhouse. And we'll start pr production. Wait, did I? Uh, yeah, I signed everything. Yes, everything is good. Now, let's go for another research. Uh, we'll go for sales booth, sales poster. Uh, I'm gonna go for air vent to increase max creeper room, improves ventilation in production rooms, and increases room rating by 15. Yeah, we'll go for this to increase, uh, and we'll make uh, working conditions a bit better for our gnomes, whatever these things are. I like the art style of this game. Okay. Because I'm marking the desk, use a marking the action. Oh, I need to do this. Yes, that's right. Um, we'll do that then. Since. E. Shop. Office. We'll need a marketing desk. Yep. Use marketing action. Yep. Yeah. yeah, that should be fine enough. Now, like I said, marketing requires a promoted clerk so uh, right now i need to see who is um novice gardener novice alchemist uh our clerk is no that's operator operator alchemist gardener clerk can i promote you yet boost assignments uh yes promote let's do Promotion into level 2. Now, uh, when you promote a clerk, you can give him additional bonus. So, let's see, cost prediction, sales fame, cap increase by 3%. Portion whisperer, all portions in the same room as this worker are 10% likely to sell. Useful, temporary increase the room rating of any. Okay. Mm. Let's go for this. Now we can, now we'll be able to use the action for a sales campaign, reduces price to increase fame. Yeah, let's do this. You see? Free action? Oh wait, I need another clerk. Because this action takes a ton of time to do. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Clerks for hire. Oof, 19. Yeah, that's what's okay, because we need a, another one. Oh, I don't have hats. Whoops. That could come back to... Oh, it's done. Okay, it's done. It's done. Some actions uh, can last... Take way longer. Look at that. How many customers. So many customers. I'm gonna soon be swimming in money. <laughs> money, money, money. Money, money, money. We have more stuff. Okay, so we have uh, a hooded cr crow. This is a rogue. We want to create our provisions. Mm, so we have provisions. I'm gonna accept and I can actually deliver right away. He wants two of them. Let's do it. Okay. 
Um, stack of coins, I'm good with money, so we go for 10% fame for 7 days. What is in this? Well, sales campaign turned out to be moderate success, fame increased by 9%. Okay, so we're gonna have a ton of customers now. I'm not doing any research right now. Um, so, okay, we have events. This uh, per temporary increases the speed of all workers who pass by it. Maybe. Safe zones. Increase the safe zone between production machines. Increase the room rating by 15. Uh, max to per room. Mm. You need a certain number of these uh, done to go to the second tier of research. Uh, basic food service increases the stamina of each worker rating here by 10 FX multiple items do not stack. Let, let, let's go do this. Let's make uh, our workers a bit happier. We seem miserable right now. We make money but we seem miserable. So let's decrease the misery. Famous friends. Yes, now we need to turn uh, Hooded Crow into Endorser. The Endorser is basically... Um, this part. Uh, rocks, 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 rocks. Basically, you need to earn a heart. You can you earn a heart by making Canada. Where you go. Now, if I can make this particular request, you should be able to uh, target with to Yeah, our. Yeah, I should, I, should, I should be able to do it. Our provisions are. Uh, I think. Uh, he has potency of two, so we should be able to do it. I just need more of them to be produced. If I can complete this mission, it will become endorser and I'm gonna complete this mission. Okay, we have one of them in store. In, st in stores. There you go, we're selling stuff nicely. Sleep Potion 14, Provisions 11, and we sold uh, two summoning potions, which is good. This is very, very good. Um, me, no, I have a bit losing money. Ah, no, it's okay. I'm making money. Making money. Money is being made. Man, speed it up. Faster, guys. I need more provisions. Maybe I should uh, prioritize provisions right now. Move. Yeah, let's do provisions. I want provisions done so I could do uh, finish this quest. So, we should be. Okay, let's fulfill the mission. We gave it our short kid, but the experience failed to reach the summit. Uh, uh, I found the best. Uh, <laughs> Insufficient delivery. What? Maybe, wait. Is my. Let's see. Products. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, potency is two. I did uh, give them two of them. So it's failed because probably RNG. Sometimes probably um, these missions just can just fail. You know something you can not because you did something wrong. You just you failed. Sintoad, Harbanja. Let's go for um, I don't know. Sim zones, sales posters. Let's go for this. Okay, uh, now we have the vents. Let's put some of them into here to make sure that this particular uh, room is fully buffed by vents. We do have additional room decorations which will increase the rating, which will help in morale. Oh. I forgot. Now let's see, can I put... Um, where is it? Where is it? Yeah, that's the thing. How big is this? Four. 
That means I'll need more space for it. Oops. Sometimes this whole drag, click and drag can be a, be a bit pain in the ass. When you want to move one uh, specific like furniture piece and you move whole room. Okay, let's uh, up upgrade this one. Our barracks now has some food. Okay. Okay, we now stocked uh, with uh, potions and seems to be doing seems to be doing good. Uh, yeah, I still need money. Well, <laughs> no, tw minus twenty six. That's not good. I will add the layer. Uh, read your papers today, partner. A little recipe of mine made its debut. Uh, Sun Blanc has made the dubbed uh, a potion of silence by several esteemed media. Raise a glass for my success. Provision is no longer superior. There you go. Now we need to uh, blitz through research, research and try to get into better stuff. Because if you go to this part, we get a decorated images and uh, a bottle caps which is, will increase the appeal of our potion which could help uh, basically making stuff now we do have additional uh, uh, upgrades like infusers uh, fermentations this is basically for like production stuff we not gonna get into this stuff because this would require to do for me to do like whole play play through series of this game to cover the entire uh, tech tree and building stuff. This is just a first look video, like last try video. So I'm not gonna go through everything, everything. Okay, so we did sold a lot of stuff. Oh, what is this? Which we want sorcery potion target grade one. Yes, I can do that. Uh, we want potion. Okay, this is being made. We only need one in our uh, stocks to fulfill, which is an easy mission to do. Okay, sometimes you just have to wait until stuff is done. We can speed up, there you go. Uh, yeah, we need only one of them. Thanks so kindly for delivery. We gathered uh, was luminous cement at the favor of okay. Spreadable good word about summoning potion. Seven days, get an artifact, we'll gain a, a random artifact. Uh, an artifact is basically this, this thingy, uh, which we built on top. You start with one uh, free, and then you can gain them like this. Sometimes you can get get them from a trader like potions, uh, like in the start of a video. So I'm gonna go for uh, spread the word because I'm not gonna like get into too in depth in like maximizing bonuses since this, like I said, you see, quick uh, view at a game. Okay, now we're gonna get now we a wizard wants two crates. And we have, yeah, why not? We can do rogues for two right away. Uh, unfortunately, best. Ah, why? Why it's failing? It shouldn't be failing at all. Oh, no? okay. Uh, yeah, I don't have money, so get out, go away. Unfortunately, I don't have a money. Yeah, my provisions are not sleep potions. Okay, something potions making good money. You know what? Let's try doing a campaign, a marketing campaign. This should help a bit. This should, this should help. Now, uh, let, oh. let's see how much we need. We need two crates. 
Okay, let's send them to crits. Uh, thank you, my friend, for the time uh, delivery. Took uh, by uh, bears of wax to them too. Is this way anything I can do for you? I could do some ingredients, get any artifacts. Uh, yeah, let's get an ingredient. Now, I could uh, establish a department store and have a second a second one over here and move this one maybe up here. Um, should be. No, oh, let's do it. It's gonna be a nice opportunity to show stuff up. Okay. We'll do this. We'll use all the available space. Oh damn, I don't have money. Okay, we're gonna start with empty room. We'll move into and um, staff uh, and staff and build stuff soon. Marking paint turned out to be a flop. Fame increased by ten. Ah, it's a flop. It's a flop. Oh, rogues. Potions of weakness. Oh, we want want potion of weakness. Yeah, I don't have a potion of weakness, so I cannot. Unfortunately, make you one. Well, I do. Would I? Let's see. What do I have? I have a potion of. Okay, let's see. Oh no, I could make a potion of weakness. Oh, let's, let's make it. This is gonna be a nice uh, ingredient uh, for uh, potion for a second uh, uh, like department. Okay, let's get rid of uh, uh, impurities. Let's see, 1.7, yeah, that's not gonna work. Mm, along this way, I'll, I'm getting more potency. Yeah, this way doesn't give me any additional potency, unfortunately. Okay. Let's see. Let's make it white. Uh, weakness. Oh, it's rivaled. Uh, yes, their appeal is a much bigger delicious solution to the appeal. Damn it, that's not gonna work. Okay, okay, then I cannot compete with this. Ah, damn it. We'll go with a different one. We'll go for a different potions. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Yes, return these things here. Okay, we, we cannot go for weakness potion because we have a rival who does it. Mm. We could just, we could do a monster repellent potion. It requires um, this one, which is a dead man's finger, if I remember correctly. Which we're already producing, so I don't have to make a, a build on a, a new. Uh, Production line, oh, not production line, but uh, uh, garden to uh, to make stuff. Okay, let's see. Impurity twenty two, one point two, one point zero seventeen. Yeah, we're gonna go for this. One point two forty two, one point five twenty three. Yeah, we're gonna go for this one. Um, gonna be a bit lower potency, but 32% uh, appeal, which is good. Eventually, we'll get more more ingredients and more, more stuff, so it's gonna be fine. Uh, if I would play this game. Okay, we'll go for this. Repellent, if I can spell it properly. 1.0 There we go Now we're gonna set up a new shop over here 
let's do this and we'll need a I could move this one into here since we need uh, two types of potions in two different categories for department to work. So we're basically gonna move this over here. If we want to expand into well, have more more products per department, we just can build additional uh, shelves and uh, that's it. Okay, we can increase sales by. Adding a poster, let's do that. Because why not? This is a shop. Okay, let's let them build. We'll add our repellent potion. Wait, uh, wait, no. I think this is not gonna work since we already have a provision. Wait, what we've done actually right now? We have. We have a provision, we have a summoning. Uh, oh. No, wait. No, 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 no. Yeah, I think we kind of covering stuff in different. Well, hopefully, it's going to be enough. Yeah, let's assign this to be. Manufactured, let's add repellent. Now, what kind of ingredients we need to make it? Let's check it out. Provisions, repellents. We need monster toe. Monster toe is a... Requires a... Cultivation box, if I remember correctly. I'm gonna place it over here. Oh, damn it, I don't have money. Whoops. Okay, for now I'm gonna remove uh, repellent since I don't want into go into in production and stall the entire production because it, what this game doesn't really do is doesn't check if it can produce stuff. It just puts stuff into here and it waits for resources. If it doesn't you know, resources, it stalls. It's not completely automatic. So you need to be careful about this part. I did. Uh, this mistake while trying to learn the game uh, at the beginning. So once I'll have money, I'll be able to solve production issues. Go cool. artifact trader. Yeah, I don't have money. Yeah, we are selling money and all stuff. We are selling stuff. Good, 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 good. Yeah, I need more money. Man, more money. Good. Now I have money. Let's build a cultivation box. Let's uh, add monster toe. Now let's check uh, what kind of um, processing this is gonna do. So it needs pickled, crushed, so we have all the processing uh, furniture, uh, like equipment, so I don't need to build anything else. Now we can finally assign uh, repellent into here. Repellent is assigned here. Okay, good. This should be... This should work. Rogues, we want provisions. Yes, I can definitely provide you provisions. We give a best shot, kid. Ah, why, why, why these rogues are so, such a big failures? They keep failing their missions. A repellent received pretty well. Let's see. Nope, it looks like that's not. Looks like that's not good enough. Uh, create two medium departments by offering two potions in two different categ categories. Oh, maybe I think two potions in two different categories. So it means I need to have two potions in, in like provisions and two potions in like maybe sorcery. Uh, I probably could do another 
sorcery maybe potions potion from this i think i'll have to move this one a bit out of the way yeah i wish uh, that i could overlay stuff this is not letting me do this that's not good okay we'll get rid of this one And we're gonna build a one more. Okay, I need to remove first. Okay. Let's make one more potion. Uh we'll go for the uh sorceress potion. Okay, what can we make? We can necromancy potion. Let's do necromancy potion. That's gonna be fine. Again, it's impure, so we need to remove impurities. Let's see. Um, 1.8, 24, 14, 2.0. Game. Okay. 2.0, 24, 15. Okay, that sh seems to be. Could be the winning. Oh, this is the best one. Yes, potency is not uh, over 2, but appeal is pretty good, so we're gonna go for this. We'll call it uh, Neck Raw Mancy Potion 1.0. We'll give it color. We'll change stuff up a bit. There you go. And uh, we'll assign it once that one is built. Necropens potion. Did I? Yeah. Uh, I need now to assign it. Mandrake. I think mandrakes require. Now let's see. Is it? Yeah. Mandrakes require a greenhouse. So we're gonna expand this one and we'll add a greenhouse over here. There you go. Add, we'll add the new. Ingredient for production. And with this we should have nice influ influx of resources and yeah, I'm not gonna buy. We have right now everything we need. I may need another uh, gardener gardener. Friendly spirit. Your source is bursting. Time to expand our Declutter or declutter to keep delivery flowing. Ready for the lesson to inventory management. No. Okay, uh, we're just gonna build another storage. Don't need too much. Just enough to store stuff. There you go, another storage. Place to store stuff. Let's uh, make stuff go faster. There you go, more space to keep stuff. There you go. Beach of Sabbath. Yeah, that's uh, one of these uh, events. Um, more customers than usual. 252% uh, uh, we're gonna be witches. Since we are making sorcery potions, like we have ne necromancy and summoning potions, uh, we should be selling out instantly. Well, as long as we have stuff in our storage. Uh, time of mall. Mana potion is hot. Appeal increased by 15%. All customer group are now looking for this potion. Now that's another event. Uh, when you get a certain demand for a particular potion. Now I do. Do I have any way to make a mana potion? Let's see. A potion of silence. Sleep potion and potion of weakness. No, I cannot make a mana potion. Unfortunately, I don't have the ingredient for it. Let's see, what do you want? You want more provisions. Um, sure, that's right. I still need to get rid of it. Okay, provision, provision, provision. If this one will work. We gave it our best shot. Yeah, he fails again. What a failure of a rogue. <laughs> I give him potions and he's failing it. It's just annoying. Okay, we're selling stuff. 
Uh, why is this stuff is not being made? Necromancy potion, mandrake. Why is men? Why why am I not making any mandrake? Mandrake. What is not letting me do? This will be skipped. So I get reached. So wait, we do have mandrake. Nightshade, Nightingale. Wait, we have it? Ah, maybe... Um, no one is delivering stuff, that's why. I may need another greaser to move stuff around. Why is stuff not, not being made... Uh, sent? Wait, I know. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Necromancy stuff. It needs dried. Uh, yeah, I need to... Another production. Okay, I need to expand my... Production. This one is gonna dry stuff. I'm gonna build it over here. This is just a temporary solution. Okay. Now we can produce... Uh, the necromancy stuff. Man, build, make it. There you go. There you go. Now we have. We are now. Uh, clock is ticking for a department store. As long as we'll keep stuff uh, stocked, we should be able to do it. I may expand the uh, cooking. Let's see, can I actually uh, hire another cooker? No, no one is for high. Wait, I do have a second cooker which no longer doing any research, so I'm gonna expand this to full length. We'll add a another cook and another bottler. If I can do this. Okay, now we'll add uh, some vents. Come on, let me press this stuff. Uh, one. And two and three, and we'll put, put, put this here to make stuff. Oh, I or bought stuff. Okay, we're gonna re remove this stuff. Uh, okay, we'll have to do without a bottler, without a second bottler. We have one bottler, mm, maybe. Maybe I could do it. Let's see, can I do it? It's damn it's it's expensive thing. Um what if I get rid of you? No, that's not gonna help. Yeah, that's not gonna help. Yeah, that's not gonna help acquire it. Okay, we're gonna We'll have to survive without a second bottler for a while. This will help me uh, do stuff faster. Uh, yes, keep producing stuff. We're gonna add things up over here so that we have a redundancies in production. So that multiple of these cookers can do multiple potions at the same time. Artwork Trader, um, Purchase and Unicorn Shoe. Mm, nah, all right, I, I like my money. I like my money. Okay, now we can expand this and buy a second bottler. Now we can do it. Now we have the money to do it. Now we have the money. Okay, let's decorate this. Please. There you go. Complete. There you go. Our second cooker kitchen slash storage is done. We are selling like hotcakes everything. Yes, three stars. And uh, five seconds. And we did it. We did it. Okay. So, as long as you... Uh, understand how to play this game. This game is quite immersive, as you can see. You can tinker with stuff. There are like optimization 
buildings like auto loaders in uh, like storage uh, areas which auto load stuff into like your production your processing so there's like a whole optimization thing you can get into so there's a lot of stuff I'll, the biggest problem is the tutorial in my opinion the game devs need to redo the tutorial make it into like it tells you step by step how to do stuff and require you to actually do them like most games have nowadays like they have like tutorial scen scenario basically where you go through and uh, basically complete that tutorial scenario basically this game needs it uh, that would be way better explanation on how stuff works especially when it comes to making potions uh, potion tutorial just basically sucks in my opinion otherwise the game is perfectly fine uh, you just need to well, understand Either watch a tutorial video, tips and tricks of video or something like this. Just don't do a tutorial. Tutorial sucks. <laughs> That's my honest opinion. The game is perfectly fine. So yeah. So if you like the video, do like and subscribe. I'd like to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Let me know what you like, what you didn't like about my uh, little view. Uh, first look. Let's try video. I was uh, interesting in hearing about stuff from you. So I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.